hey everyone and welcome back to our channel in today's video we are going to show you how to edit the cover or default thumbnail of a video in CapCut. let's begin now the first thing that you need to do is to log in using your credentials if this is your first time in CapCut, i want you to click the sign up option from here just follow the on-screen instructions and you're good to go to edit the cover or the default thumbnail of a video in CapCut, you just have to follow with these simple steps. Launch CapCut on your PC and then click the new project if you want to begin your work or to start from scratch. But if you have already an existing project, just click on it to begin editing. And then import the video you want to edit by clicking this option right here from the video file from your computer or you can just go to the library section where there are thousands of videos that you can import directly here on your timeline okay so for example this one now if you want to edit the cover or the default thumbnail of a video you see there is a small icon here that says click to edit cover and you will be forwarded to this section a new pop-up window wherein you can move the playhead to the beginning of the video or whatever part of the video you want to create a uh, thumbnail frame as we call it that would be the cover image you see if you select the video right here and then click edit you will be forwarded to a new interface wherein you can customize the thumbnail frame by clicking the save button right here Wait for it and it will be loaded to your timeline. So you have now a customized cover, which is going to be this one. And again, if you want to edit that, if you're not satisfied with the editing, just click on the edit cover. Wait for it. And then here, as you can see, you can implement customized information for the uh, uh, thumbnail or cover. You can put in, for example, a design template, maybe add this inside of your uh, thumbnail right and of course you can customize all of the information here it's all up to you you can also choose from any of the following and once you're happy with the for example this you can simply click then the edit and then click the save button and once you're happy with how it is Click the export button to save it for from different file formats. Thank you so much for watching. We will see you again in the next video.